Good afternoon. They were about to get away with a whole lot of loot. Now we know just how much. We told you yesterday how an alert deputy stopped two male thieves in the act. Now we have the video. Here's News 13's Cheyenne Cope. Early Tuesday morning, Sandoval County Deputy Robert Torres was doing neighborhood checks in the Placitas area when he noticed something strange. A man and woman acting suspiciously, trying to open a community mailbox with a screwdriver and a wrench. Just making sure you guys live up here and using your own mailboxes. He started asking questions, like if the couple lived in the area. They said yes, but when he asked them what street, the woman, 21-year-old Alexis Groves, said she didn't know. That's when the deputy knew something wasn't right. Uh, any weapons on you? Huh? Any, no, nothing at all? You take the keys out of the ignition. But instead of doing that, she starts the car. Take the keys out of the ignition. And takes off, nearly hitting the officer with the vehicle and leaving behind her partner in crime, 24 year old Paul Garcia. A short time later, the vehicle was spotted by Bernalillo police. She led them on a chase before crashing. Groves was found unconscious and taken to the hospital. In the car's trunk, officers found boxes and boxes of what they suspect is stolen mail. He kept trying to get in the car, and I knew he had something in there. They've been robbing all kinds of mailboxes, huh? Have they? Yeah. Yep. Cheyenne Cope, KRQE, News 13. Well, she's only 21. Alexis Groves already has quite a criminal history, including drugs and theft. She was just arrested in March for theft of a credit card and in June for receiving stolen property. Garcia has one arrest for receiving a stolen vehicle back in July. Both are still in jail.